All right. All right, we are back with another set. We are in uh <laughs> winner's semis. Which is crazy. I, uh AOG made it really far. Good job. And I hope I honestly am kind of I'm rooting for the bark the dark, but uh I wouldn't complain if uh Kuroko won <laughs> or if uh AOG. I'm gonna call them AOG because that's in their name. I don't feel like calling them Seven Ghost. So we have AOG versus Seven Ghost. Or we have AOG Seven Ghost versus Dark of the Void Variety. Squeezes Minus. I go out on my own terms. Alright, so we're getting to game one. Now, honestly. Dark Void, if Dark Void loses this set, this is free. Or not free, but it's possible that I basically get into grands. However, this is a very unlikely set for Dark Void to lose, as he knows the Tona matchup. He probably knows the Fed matchup fairly well, too. I'm definitely hoping that Dark Void wins, because then top 3 for 1BG. Or top 3 has two 1BG members. Ooh, but that Nair Dare Bear. Now... I don't know if you know this, but, uh, AOG is actually a friggin' keyboard player, which is hype, so, um, that's one thing, while Dark Void is playing on key, isn't, pl is playing on their standard controller, which is normal, <laughs> and, uh, well, it doesn't really matter, <laughs> at her, because, uh, it's Dark Void, Dark Void always wins, even when Dark Void loses, Dark Void wins, so, um, Dark Void, though, does have a small lead. Now, the thing with, um, Seven Ghost is that they have a very different tone of set to mine. Very different. Oh, wait, no, I'm gonna turn off hitboxes. And if I lose my, uh, winner's final set, I'm gonna turn off hitboxes, and if I lose my loser's final set, I'm gonna turn them off for grands. Now, um, Dark Void is, uh, pretty fucking cracked, but, um... AOG might be able to squeeze out some lucky kills. But at the same time, they're clearly struggling to just take out this one stock. <laughs> and it's pretty upsetting, actually, because it seems like they just don't know the Amuji matchup at all. Which can definitely be a reason to lose, not knowing the matchup. Also, I'd like to say right before this, they said no matter the character, I'm gonna win. And they are getting bibbity bopped. But, um, it's still very doable because it's Tona. But, uh, oh my god, a back throw kill. We need to appreciate that more. Oh my god, I'm 36%. Or 39. Yeah, 39. Now they're at 50. And that looks like it could be the end of the stock. And that up smash, nice read. A lot of people go for that dodge in to try and get back into the stage and uh if you know that people are gonna go for that you can just get kills at like 60 especially if you're a muji now dark void is cracked with a muji he's been going to muji the entire tournament actually and so it's really impressive to see that he's doing well with uh this character that's ranked seventh or sixth right now or no seventh he's doing really well with a very good character but um one that mo he would, I feel like it was more expected for him to switch to Fenton after the uh, nerfs, but um, he's clearly showing how to make it work. He's showing that you don't need them. He doesn't need the broken shit, because he is the broken shit. And that up he doesn't kill. I think Dark Void expected it to kill. Now, this is still very doable for Seven Ghost, but um, I don't know if... Uh, I don't know if Seven Ghost is good enough at the Zero to Deaths to make that happen. I don't know if Seven Ghost is good enough as a player to make that happen. That fair, though, nearly takes it. And that nice down air. Okay, that was clean. That was a clean down air. Ooh, nice. Getting that nice side beat off. And that up smash. Alright, Seven Ghost on the... With their backs against the wall. Will they switch? Nope, they want to do the stadium. Alright, that was a nice short um, game one.
Alright, so we're getting into game two. <laughs> oh no! Alright, good. Thank god I hit the person with the healing move. Ooh, I am so mad at myself because I meant to run off. There we go. There we go. Okay, now I'll run off. Alright, now, Seven Ghost has an advantage. Eric got that first hit. It really depends on, because in this matchup, both of these characters have great combos, but uh, Seven Ghost just really couldn't get them kills. And that was where uh, Tona, his Tona struggled. But, uh, nice, uh, nice percent getting him to 44. Um, also, if I, oh my god, he has the lead right now, but, uh, this is a Muji, and, uh, Nair Chains are still a very real threat. Ooh, night nice, smart. I don't know if it was intentional to use that projectile, but it doesn't matter. Dark Void had him off stage, and he did what he needed to. And now that is a very fucked, um... Uh, very fucked, uh, eight, or, um, seven ghost. There's not much you can really do in this situation, because if Dark Void has the lead, he's gonna take advantage of it. <laughs> And there isn't much you can really say against it, but that back air takes the stock, and he gains 3 HP back in the process. Ooh, all 6. Which, I mean, to be fair, he did get double grabbed. Triple grabbed. Okay, Dark Void. I think you're feeling it yourself a bit too hard. Ooh, and that down air... Ooh, AOG has the lead, and now that Uppy is gonna take the game, take the lead again. <laughs> Alright. And that back air. Ooh, goes for that down air, doesn't get it. Doesn't get it, but wow, absolutely would have killed. I would have gone for down air there, but uh, okay, that was upsetting. <laughs> but I mean, hey, Seven Ghost is back in this, and it's very possible that Seven Ghost could win. As this is Tona, but, um, that fair- Oh, that was so clean- No! Dark Void, what are you doing? And we're going to game three! <laughs> Ask Dark Void if he wants to de- <laughs> I think that counts as two losses. Bad. <laughs> that was so bad. But you know what? I think Dark Boy just knew he was gonna win. When he was going to a bit of style. And uh, Koji is on a time limit here, by the way. <laughs> Alright, so, uh, he got the mama. He got the mama RNG, which um, is not very good RNG apparently. He got talked to by the mom, and that wasn't very good. All right, so somehow we're going to game three against or with um, seven versus Dark Void. <laughs> this should not have happened. But I guess Tonos are just the natural predators of the emoji. Seven Ghost wins this. This will be so funny. And if Seven Ghost wins this, I will laugh my ass off so hard. Mm, boom. Bam. Bop. Bada. Bop. Alright, now we're getting into game... Three, which I never thought I'd be saying that against, um, with Seven Ghost versus Dark Void. <laughs> but I mean, Seven Ghost did get a nice bit of percent, and does have a nice little lead. 
And, um, but the thing is, against him, in Rumble, you're never really winning. <laughs> like, this is an even game right now, and we all know it. <laughs> Seven goes could be at zero, and it'd be even. Ooh, that nice little, um, little thingy-majigger. That nice little spin. Fuck! Spear. Flipping him. Ooh, and that, that was honestly optimal, because then his shield would've got broken. Big brain strats coming to you since 1991 in that sad down air. That was so sad. <laughs> and I think uh, that's like the motive. That's like the confidence killer. Not even kidding. That's like how you lose all confidence you had in a second. Ooh, that was a nice kill. Oh no, my fucking controller. <laughs> okay, well, this is honestly a lot closer than expected. But, um, I think Dark Boy's got this one in the bag. It would be funny, though. I will give it that. It would be, uh, it would go down in history as the best set of all time. Greatest upset ever, and will be uploaded to YouTube, meaning I will be able to get them nice, sweet, and YouTube views. Ooh, that nice little thing. That was a nice little combo. Oh, that downbeat affair, and that dash attack nearly takes it. Ooh, and that neutral layer. That's, like, probably secures the set for Void. Very good showing by, um, AOG, uh, almost taking it off of Dark. Oh, never mind. This is, this is still interesting. Now, Semgo's still trying to keep himself alive for as long as he can, but it's just futile. Then again, it's not impossible, and I know people want this upset. And, um, oh, the down air. Oh, the down air. The up B. The up air. Oh, oh, no. That almost ended it. Oh, poor Seven Ghost. He's got to be sad right now. And that fireball hitting him. <laughs> he has just got to be upset. He knows he should have won by now, and instead he has to keep playing against Dark Over that downbeat, and that takes it! Oh my god! What the fuck am I watching? This is a world where AOG can fucking take down Dark Void! What the fuck am I watching? Oh my god! That downbeat! Holy shit! Oh my god! What the hell was that? <laughs> That was some HBox DI on Dark Void, and now we have fucking seven ghosts and losers finals proving all you have to do to win is fucking believe, and he is making a damn good case. Oh my god. <laughs>